there's a salaciousness <laughs> to it, but it's not necessarily in the in in the way that they expect it. Mm -hmm. So we give the audience what they want, but it's just not in the way they expect it. Yeah. Yeah. I think um, with this film, it, we just sort of see two people who are, uh, meet each other and, and are thrown into this kind of whirlwind and nothing makes sense about it. And that's what I love about it, because how often does love really make that much sense? Um, and it really questions that. Like, you have an ideal and you think this is what you want, and then something else happens and messes up your whole idea of love. In terms of preparing, how do you prepare yourself to fall in love on screen? Oh, uh, good question. That is a good question. Uh, I, look, at first I would say Canadians and Australians, as you could attest to, have very sort of similar sentimentalities, lust for life, sense of humor, and then combined with the fact that she's just a sort of a naturally gorgeous, vivacious woman, it made it pretty easy for me, to be honest. <laughs> she had to work a lot ditto. harder. I think ditto to all that. Thank I God I didn't have this moustache when we were shooting the film. <laughs> Would have been a completely different movie. Yeah. I think, uh, yeah, I think it's that, and I think it's just going to set and feeling, okay, I'm just going to be open to this. I'm going to put my heart on the table, and I think we took good care of each other's hearts, and I think I can thank Ryan for that. Yeah.